Today I'm going to show you how to install Distant Horizons for Minecraft 1.20.1 but with Forge. So you can use other mods that's only available in Forge. And surprisingly I got pretty good FPS, I was not expecting that. But before we start, please follow what I do next and watch till the end or you will get errors. Now go in description and download all the mods and keep them in a folder. In my last video some of you were having issues about finding fabric loader. So first we need to install forge loader, locate where you download the mods and find forge installer. Double click on it, install and wait till it finishes installing. After that open run command by pressing windows icon plus R. So you have to press them at once. And type percent app data percent and go to your minecraft directory and locate mods folder. Now drag and drop all your mods into minecraft mods folder and open your minecraft launcher. Go to installation and locate forge loader 1.20.1 and click on these three dots and set your ram here. You can set minimum 2gb ram but I recommend more since it helps a lot and more is better. So I'm gonna put all the ram I have that is 8gb and launch your minecraft. Now wait for it to install and load resources. If it crashes you're probably using wrong version of mods so cross check them once again here's the list. By the way join my discord for help and if you want to download the whole mod pack in one click. We have a great community, there are almost 300 members and no one talks so it's quite peaceful. And let's just keep it that way. Now when your Minecraft is loaded and you are in main menu, go to option distant horizon settings and copy everything here as same as me. After that start making your Minecraft world. By the way turn off distant horizons and shaders for now and type these three commands and sometimes you need to type like extra command like slash chunky confirm type that if you if no progress bar shows up this mod called chunky pregenerate chunks for you and helps distant horizon to load vast render distance faster this process will take a while depending on your pc and how much radius you wanted it to load the clip you watched in start was 200 radius that took like 30 minutes for me to load but one downside to using high radius is that it will increase file size of your world folder. Well, still worth it if your world looks this beautiful. Now after the progress bar is finished, leave your world and join again and turn on distant horizons. Wait for a file for it to load everything, then turn on your shaders. You can find compatible shaders, link in description if you use any other shader. It won't work so download from the link in description below. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more amazing video about Distant Horizons or any other mods. Bye bye.